everyone. Uh, I just got back from the hospital because I needed to get a refill on some eye drops. Uh, I had photorefractive keratectomy about two months ago, which is a procedure that fixes your vision by reshaping your cornea with a laser. It's amazing. I recorded about an hour and a half worth of footage on my last dang video. Well, I only was about to, really, there was only about 15 minutes of usable content in there. I actually put a lot of shitty content in there because I liked the stuff I was showing or whatever. Uh, shitty as in it was very windy. So, I'm trying keeping my visor closed. I actually just realized that the last light I had it open, but I wasn't really moving either. Uh, so, I'm going to try and keep the speeds down. I need a new helmet. I need a lot of new things, but you know what? Money doesn't grow on trees. Oh, look, it's closed. What am I doing? What, what was I thinking about coming up here anyway? Like, the, closed for maintenance. Park closed. This is a park? See? I have to visit this at a later date. steep these turns are so I'm taking it very 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 slow I remember when I came through here in my car um, there was a lot of bikes that were really whipping it through here and yeah I'm just I'm not gonna go into a turn with that oh shit feeling I hate that feeling where you're like I either have to really lean this thing or I'm fucked but if I lean it too much, I'm fucked. So I am not touching that. I am just, I am just babying it through these turns. Here is uh, El Paso. Over there, what is it, Red Star? I, I'll see if I can get a better view of it once I go around this turn. But that Red Star is Mexico. Uh, all right, I'll try and get it here. Just to show you how close the city of El Paso is to the border of Mexico. Um, no, I can't stand up because of the dude behind me, but right over there, there's a, uh, there's the star, red star. The guy behind me is look, putting his hands up like, what is this dude pointing to? Well, listen, buddy, I am trying to vlog. So, yeah, this is a much cooler road than I remember, I guess. Okay, you can't really do it justice being in a car, but, uh, I think there's an observatory tower up here, uh, somewhere, but not, not a tower, uh, just a landing. Um, but look at how high we are. See, I remember it being a lot more sketchy. I don't remember this wall here, but even with the wall, it's still a little bit sketchy. But I love this kind of shit. I, I love roads that are like freaky. Like, look at these power lines. Look at how they're like draping down like this. I think that uh, that stuff is great. Like, the fact that this was built into a damn mountain. This road, I just... I love I love the stuff that, that humans can do. I don't... Even though I don't have much to say right now, I'm just really absorbing all the, the scenery. But I'm not going to make any cuts, even when I'm not chatting, because uh, I want to get the whole road. So I'm going to pull over right here. Right here. very high up don't really want to walk around with my helmet on currently this guy's enjoying his lunch but uh, yeah so what I, that's what I was trying to point out that red x-ray over there I don't know why I was trying to point it out I don't it's because I didn't remember this little parking area at the time but it's very steep there's a little like walkway down there and then it's just a complete drop-off. 
so it doesn't look that high, but it's pretty high. Um, the fan just came on on my shadow here because it is, um, uh, let's see, 79 degrees, and I am not moving. So the radiator is not getting any wind. So the bike has to make wind, but when it starts doing that, that's when it's time to move. Some plaques, I, I don't know, there's a lot, there's a lot of different stuff up here. Uh, if, you, if you walk around and look. Like, look at that really sketchy road. I know that's not for people. I, it looks like it goes up to that tower up there for, uh, for maintenance. Uh, but I just want to drive up it, even though I feel like I would, I would sketch me out, but I want to go up that thing so bad, but there's a little chain, so you wouldn't be able to go too far. A lot of people do that shit. When they, when they drive, uh, that's why I hug the, you might be like, why are you hugging it so close right here? Because people make these turns too fast, and they say, oh shit, and then drive right over the yellow line. Uh, so if I can't see, if it's a blind corner, I don't really want to get hit. I think that's pretty much the end. Uh, and not only is it a neat little ride, but it's actually a huge shortcut. It saves you a lot of, uh, of, uh, of, of red lights and, and traffic. So a lot of times there'll be actually quite a few cars driving through here. I'm going to close my visor now because I'm always leaving it open. Leaving all sorts of wind. Jesus Christ! Well, this dog wants to obviously die. My God. You don't know. I was just talking about this earlier. About how these dogs in this city almost commit suicide. And not to mention, normally almost kill me because I overreact every time I see an animal. I don't know what to do. I don't want to kill somebody's pet, but I also don't want to wipe out.